Hi guys, so I built my own DIY electric skateboard. Um, this is like uh, 1500 watts, uh, about 2000 watts. I'm not exactly sure on the motor specs. I think it's 5560. Um, anyway, I got a very small battery in here and this is way lighter than my Mini S. I think maybe six pounds. Anyway, um, let's go and test it out and I'll tell you all about it after. But this is what it looks like. It looks like a regular skateboard with giant wheels. I think it looks really funny. I'm gonna start down the uphill here. Um, it does break. Brakes are a little iffy. So the ESC that I'm using is not that smooth for braking. But hopefully, oh, it'll be great. sensitive braking is really sensitive on the advanced level let me try on a medium level yeah medium is a lot better I think it's actually too fast on the advanced level We're pretty good. Um, I tightened the trucks a little too much for speed, but yeah, this board 
Uh, the stick, the stack is not that great for, uh, I think these reels. I think it's too, too narrow. Um, so one thing I definitely learned is definitely, I'm gonna need to uh, play with the different trucks. But it can go fast. It's that. Yeah, so it's, it does have regenerative braking. I might have to change out the ESC. Uh, it seems like it seems like the ESC is not not as good. I So guys, uh, pretty successful. Um, again, this is just a prototype. Uh, my f final version is going to be a lot better than this. Um, but uh, I think I'm going to have to use another ESC because the cheap Chinese one I got um, is not as smooth. It's, it's pretty good. And also I'll, I'll put a very little battery. This is super light board. I mean, if you, if you want a lot of power on flat ground, um, this would be a perfect setup because with the belt, dual belt, you got a hell of a, a lot of power, so 1500 watts. But I got a real small battery in there. But if you go on flat ground, it's just so, still give you good six, seven miles. Now, if you go on hills, it might have a little trouble. But also, I used my old regular skateboard as a deck, and I think that could be a problem, or my trucks could be a little too tight. I'm actually not sure. I'll have to play with it, but. I'm actually pr pretty glad nothing blew up. This is just a prototype. But yeah, not too bad. Not too bad at all. But very, very powerful. So the, the total cost, I paid uh, $120 for the motors. And the uh, the front trucks, so $120. I paid 100 bucks uh, for the battery, so that's 220. And I paid 50 dollars uh, for the ESE, the cheap Chinese 50 dollar ESE. So I total total of 220, uh, 270 for this build. Actually, the battery box is additional 20, but this one I'm not going to use. I just I just bought it because I didn't have anything else to use. Of course, you you can use any deck you want, uh, but for 270. You can pretty much, you can get a nice little board going. But again, this is a prototype. Um, I will have a, 
I'll have a uh, more finished version. Not as satisfied as I, I would like. Um, the ride is a little, little jittery uh, due to the ESC that's used on it. So I'll definitely have to work on it, but yeah, not too bad. Anyway, have a great day, guys. I'll see you guys on the next one.